What is up guys, that man Leroy here today. I'm doing something very different today. I'm doing an unboxing video. You already see my shadow in the thing there, hello. I'm full of cold, I feel like absolute crap, but nevertheless, I'm gonna do this for you anyway. Today, this unboxing is a Yusagi Handforged Katana. I bought this a few weeks ago from bladesuk.com. And it looks spectacular. First things first, we've got in here, if you can just drag that up to the camera, that's like backwards maybe, is that backwards? Probably it's backwards, I don't really know. Anyway, this is the Certificate of Authenticity, proves it was handmade. Curved blades over 50 centimeters being illegal in the UK unless they are handmade. We've got a DVD showing the explanation process, or the, the forging process, the hand forging process. Cute little box, let me just get in this little box here. Oh, excuse me. In this little box, we've got, if you can see, we've got a little chamois leather, what appears to be. Very cute. A little puffy thing that makes, if you can see that coming off of it. I'm not quite sure what that does. But I'm looking, going to look it up eventually. We've got, also in the little box, we've got a little hammer. See the little hammer? How cute is that little hammer? Look at that. Look at that shit little hammer. And we've got oil. Oil, there's oil. I'm trying to do this on a webcam, it's very difficult. I'm not feeling very well at all, guys. <coughs> so this is basically the maintenance kit of the sword. Now, I must, must stress, this is not a toy, nor is this a display. This is a fully functioning katana. This thing is sharp as balls. I've had a little look already, so let me just get it out. Ooh. Out of the bag, it comes in a little bag. Ooh. Come on, come on. There it goes. Once again, it's got the label Koto Katana written on it. Ooh. It's a black lacquered. Let me see if I can angle this down the camera so you can see just how long this thing is. This thing is about, what, 40 centimeters, 50 centimeters long? Look at the size of that bastard. We've got that genuine ray skin in the handle. It's the best angle for this. There you go. This thing is long. Very long. Ooh. And very fucking sharp. It's carbon steel, 100% hand forged, folded carbon steel. Blade. It's a bit dusty because of the oil and the powder, I'm guessing. So yeah, look at that. That is fucking just wow, guys. <laughs> just wow. This is not, probably not the best unboxing video you'll ever get to see in your life. Let's see how close we can get to this bad boy. Let's see how close we can get without oil uh, too much. But she's a beauty, an absolute beauty. So yeah, this thing, full tag, which basically means the metal from the blade goes all the way into the bottom of the handle. Fully pegged, it's none of this rat tail crap, which means the, the steel will go down to there. Which means this thing is fully functional. And absolutely amazing. Basically, yeah, that's my <coughs> unboxing video for you guys. It's not very long. Not very interesting, it's made of carbon steel, so it's gonna be constant maintenance because oxygen actually reacts with the carbon in the steel and makes it rust, which is never ever a good thing. So yeah, this thing uh sent from bladesuk.com if you want to check them out. It's what's called the Yasagi Hand Forge Katana. It's a very beautiful blade, a by comparison. If I can leave that one in there. Stay there, I've got a couple more. This one, this one is a decorative piece only. As you can see, it's straight, so it's not been hand forged. See this simulated temper. It's not bent, because it's not been hand made. It's not been it's not curved compared to this one. It's a tray, thank you. But the uh, the tag goes to about, I don't know, halfway down the halfway down the handle about there, which means it's not, it's not a, how do I say, it's not a, uh, a piece that you'd use, it's, it's a decorative piece only. And the weight between the two is quite substantial. 
as you can see also look at the you can just see the difference I'll leave that in the picture there for you so yeah two swords same length entirely different quality this the Usagi the, the Katana this one would do some severe damage to anything this one well it looked pretty they didn't snap off over your head basically but I bought it because it looks pretty and yeah pretty much not overly sharp it's a little bit sharp but don't get me wrong it would do some damage to the cardboard which I'm not going to do although I, I would like to I was not feeling upset at the minute maybe in a future video if you wanted to see it so I could, I could quite happily do that with this one and nothing will come of it see Go down the hand nothing but I would not do it with this one <laughs> I would not dare do it with this one because I'll take my hand off so yeah this has been a my unboxing video thank you very much for watching guys see you soon